Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome to today's vlog. Um, I've got more workout footage for you guys today from my leg day, and I was going to discuss how that went as I talked about it. So today, as I said, was leg day, and I had to back off on weight on a lot of my exercises. I started doing my squats, and lately I've been doing 225 for four sets of five on my first leg day of the week. Second leg day of the week is high reps, so um, it's a lot lighter weight for three sets of 15 reps. But today, so I've been doing 225 for quite some time now, and it felt heavy, you guys. Like, 225 felt... <laughs> it felt like it was 250 for me this week. So as bad as it sucked, I had to, so I did one set of, um, three, I did three reps at 225. Anything other than that, my form would have been shit. I could have hurt my back. So I racked it and I went down to 185 and I did three more reps there. So that was my first set. My second set I did uh, 205. So all the other sets I did 205 for five sets, four sets of five, three sets of five, sorry. And I haven't had to do 225 or 205 in quite some time, but I just, and the rest of my leg day, I had to back off on weight or everything felt really heavy. So just wanted to throw this out there for you guys and let you know that every week is not going to be awesome. Not every workout is going to be awesome. Progress is not linear. Weightlifting physical progress, mental progress, it's not linear. We're not always going to be progressing in an upward or forward motion. Some days we have to back off on the weight. So today it would look like I took a step backwards. But you can't let that one step backwards overshadow the 400 steps forward that I've made in the last several years. So always be thinking of how you come out at the end of the week or at the end of the month or at the end of the year. See if you're always moving forward in that sense because if I were to look at today's workout, I would have taken it as a loss and I could have focused on that. I would have thought that I was a failure, that I was going backwards, but I can guarantee you that in the next few weeks, my the weight that I do will go back up to 225 and eventually it will go past 225 for my four sets of five reps. So I just wanted to encourage you guys this morning with that and let you know that people that, even people that go in the gym every day, I'm by no means a professional, but whenever people go in every day, it's not always a good workout. And you have to remember that even Olympians, even Mr. Olympia, <laughs> they have bad workouts. It happens, but they don't focus on the bad because they know there's so much more good happening in the long term. So I just want to encourage that for you guys today. Update on what I'm doing today. I am in about an hour. I'm going to be meeting my um, friend slash sister-in-law to do a body combat class. I don't know if any of you guys have been here for a while. Y'all know that I used to take body combat a lot. It's a kickboxing style class. Most of you that go to the gym or group fitness probably have heard of it. I freaking love it. I've always loved kickboxing and that type of fast pace, like punching and kicking stuff. So we're going to meet at a gym that offers that class and we're going to take it together. I haven't done it in at least a year. And then going back to where this is my first week of cardio, it's going to be interesting to see how that goes, but it's going to be fun. So we have that. And then I have uh, we're going to be climbing tonight, too. So today is a very active day for me. Oh, speaking of which, I need some carbs. So I'm going to have a Lenny and Larry's cookie right now. And I emailed my coach regarding what he wants me to do on days like this. They're not going to happen often, but as I start training for cycle more, I'm going to start taking more cycle classes. So it's going to be additional cardio. Every coach approaches this type of stuff differently. So... Of course, I'm going to stick to my plan that my coach has for me and what I would do for my own clients. Um, just depending on their goals, I would have them add in a few extra carbs, just depending on the activity. So um, I'm curious to see what he says. He might keep my stuff the same. He might say add some food. So I'll just do whatever my coach tells me to do. So I'm going to have this cookie, Lenny and Larry's oatmeal raisin cookie. And I'm going to go work from Starbucks for 
probably about 30 minutes, answer a few emails, and then head to the class. I'm not going to get any footage because it's not my gym, and I don't know how they are about filming, so yeah. I'll see you guys later. This is a good one. Lots of oatmeal in this one. There's a piece of hair on it. I hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you don't mind me talking with my mouth full. I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. See y'all later today. What'd you think? Um, so I was gonna tell you guys and this guy, I'm at Matt's office. Are you interested in hearing about how body combat went today? Sure. So basically this morning, I had the genius idea to do my leg workout and then body combat. And then I, so I got done with my leg workout at like 9.30, body combat started at 10.25 in Buda, so I had to drive all the way over there. So basically I went from one to the next. Well, I was worried that I hadn't had enough food, so I ate a Lenny and, Larry, Lenny and Larry's cookie and a Cliff Bar on the way over. And then my quads cramped so bad during the class <laughs> that I couldn't like. Doing moves like you're supposed to be like this. I was having to go like this. <laughs> That's embarrassing. <laughs> it was really bad. And then, but I mean, it was fun. Um, Jen had fun. Jen did go. We'll probably go again soon, but I won't do legs first because that was the worst idea I've ever had um, regarding workouts. Like, I'm not kidding. It was the worst idea ever. But it was, I got it done. I didn't have to, I didn't leave early. What's the moral of the story? Don't work out. Wrong. Wrong. <laughs> right now we're gonna go to my parents' house and decorate gingerbread cookies with my nephew. And not them out the redheaded cookies. I poked my lip with my straw. <laughs> my arm is tired. Oh, okay, we're gonna go over this. Wow, it'll be even cooler at night. It'll be really cool at night. But I think they even set them to music. Thanks, so. Cookies. Hi. Sorry, I was right in the middle of giving Agent a bath. Oh, I was trying to get him done before <laughs> you guys got over. Uh, <laughs> Hello? Go. Agent? <laughs> Baby! Baby! Hi, Baby! <laughs> Hi! Oh. Look at the tree. Aww. And the tree. So beautiful. It's that right? Are they still? Whoa. Like single colors. I want you one. Have you tried it on the house yet? Not yet. I'm gonna do it right now. Turn off these other lights. It's okay. This is so cool. We'll do it. We should shine yeah, the neighbors. Wait to see what it looks like on the house. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? <laughs> You have a square in Isn't my face. Isn't that cool? I have a square in my face. See See? Right there? Because it says, this is your face. How <laughs> do you have to do this? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Mine's coming along pretty nicely. Agents looks good, Matt. Well, let me add more of these before you. <laughs> yeah, you get a. Thank Mine's you. A boy. You get a participation medal, Matt. Oh my goodness! What? <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't finished. <laughs> um. <laughs> He's pretty. Don't lick it. <laughs> let me see it. Let me let me zoom in on that bad boy. <laughs> oh my gosh. That one's mine. <laughs> Ooh, you like my yummy. I'm just going to eat this one. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's, I mean, we have plenty. Just, if you, okay, if thank you, you. want to eat one, you can. It's mine. No one's mine. No one's mine. Oh, no. So you ate him? You ate him? <laughs>
You. <laughs> Emma. Aww. Aww. It's a monster gingerbread. This one's the best. Good, now I eat this. Um. <laughs> that one's the best. <laughs> Do that again. <laughs> <laughs> Is he gonna make it all the way around? I like the uh, the face that you have with that. <laughs> He's boot look at that one! Whoa! And then look at that one! Whoa! Not gonna say anything. So I didn't know you're recording. Yeah, so, right. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that awesome clip of our nephew. Because he's pretty much the coolest, weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life. Um, <laughs> but I'd hang out with him. Yeah, do you have any thoughts for the day, Matt? Conclusions, thoughts, things of that sort? I was just at work all day. Don't do the eyebrows. I was just at work all day. Aside from my legs cramping, um, during body combat and it being like really embarrassing because I couldn't do anything. I'm not kidding you guys. I had to modify everything in that class. I was the only one that wasn't jumping whenever they were jumping. I couldn't like, I, I couldn't even put anything into my punches because my legs were literally cramping. Um, so let that be an encouragement for you guys. Just do your own thing. Do what works. Hopefully next time I go in, I won't have done legs beforehand and I can actually put some effort into it rather than try not to die. But it was a good day. Um, Topic suggestion for tomorrow. What do you got? You, behind the camera. We're seeing a movie, yeah. We are seeing a movie, but we can't show them that. We don't have time for them. Hey, we got time. Fine, we'll make time. I'll make time. All right, guys, he's not helping. <laughs> That's going to end this video, and we will see you tomorrow. I don't know what the topic is. I'll think of something. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching, as always. As always, thank you for watching. I appreciate you guys. Love you guys. Bye.